back again. I've had a little break now. Um, I was getting a bit frustrated, so I wanted to have a break just so I can refocus on things. Um, and hopefully, we'll get a better result uh, in the next in the next game. You know, <clears throat> I'm not going to try and chop the, the chop the um, formation again because I don't see that that would be beneficial. I think uh, we'll give it a couple more games and then we'll uh, see if we need to change it after that then we can look at doing that so that's the uh, that's the idea I think yeah I've got to give it a go <clears throat> I don't know I, I, I know I called I know I called this but it doesn't mean it's not any less frustrating because it really is and I just wish I <clears throat> had a magic magic sponge or something to, to make it better but no we don't so I'm just going to have to see how we're doing I'm just going to have a quick look at the finances see if we're still in the green because it was going down I know yeah we're alright we've we're still making a made a profit this season which which is good news how much longer that's going to last I don't know because look <clears throat> we've lost 115 grand in one month which is quite a lot Some of that's down to the increase in wages that we're doing now. Because we've got quite a lot of players on over a thousand pound a week now, plus staff and and all that. And I think that's that's going to make a difference to to making money. We're at the cup again, so well, you know, no money to be made there. Unfortunately, I mean, if if we can get through maybe the the week cup, maybe we can make a bit there. But we'll have to see. Because I want to try and go into next season with a profit. Or at least break even. Oh, great. Two injuries. So that just makes things easier. Oh, he's in the Northern Ireland under 21 squad, is he? Anybody we know in that squad? Cleary, I've heard of him. I think he's at Derby, isn't he? Yeah. Decent, very decent player. 40,000. Hmm. I wonder if they'll let me loan it. No, I can't loan anybody else. Okay. Of course, it's only two... Two loans at a time, isn't it? Okay, not to worry. We'll have to... We'll have to see how we get on. I think, look at that for a name, Torpedo Moscow, I like that name, <laughs> UEFA Cup before it was renamed Europa League now of course, on this game as well there's still such a thing called the Intertoto Cup, um, which is essentially, for want of a better word, the third choice European Cup, so you've got your Champions League, which is your top four in the Premier League for basing it on that. UEFA Cup, which is, um, you know, the next best group of teams. And then you've got the Intertoto Cup, which is the next best highest placed team that's not already in Europe. So um, that's how it works. Go to a bit of direct passing, get some hard tackling in there. Remember behind the ball, yes. And that's all I'm going to change. Let's see how we go. Lincoln, where are they on the table? Um, 14th, so it's a winnable game. Definitely a winnable game. We need to win it as well. Come on. Not a good start. Second chance coming up already. Well, look at things. This is bad news. Okay. Oh no! Already one nil down already. This is this is very very disastrous. D 
disappointing. Whoa. Could have been a penalty there. Fortunately, it wasn't. The annoying thing is we're not losing games by 3-4-0. It's the odd goal here and there. So it's, it's little fine margins. No. Good save, keeper. Well done. Okay, we've not had a chance yet. This isn't going very well, is it? Look at this, we're getting absolutely battered. Oh, I was at least we had a chance. That's good. Let's see if we can create some more, because we're not creating a great deal at the moment. We must keep going. Come on. Oh, it saved it. Unlucky. Go on. Go on. Oh, I saved it. Marriott. Is that Andy Marriott? I think it is. Or oh, Alan Marriott. That's it. Sorry. I remember him. I think he was a bit of an LMA manager legend. Who remembers that game? On the old PS2. Go on. <sighs> oh, he's proving it. Look, he's saving everything. Keep going. Come on, guys. Absolutely nothing is happening. Hodge needs to come off, he's having a bad game. So we'll put Horon Stevens can come on instead of Solly. I'll go with two up top. That hopefully could turn the screw. That's uh, that's what I'd like to think. Let's see. Might have to go back to two up front. See how this goes. Dangerous. Uh oh. Alden Weaver. Come on, we just need to hold it. Hold the ball. Oh no. No. going to get another one it's coming you can see it I can just see maybe if we nick one then we've got a chance but uh, defeat after defeat after defeat after defeat I don't know how much longer I can carry on with this with the board I mean I'm not going to quit the game but the board might uh, might have something to say if we don't do something soon I don't get it because we're doing really well at the start of the season. I've already mentioned that. I've alluded to that. And uh, it's just all gone a bit peaked on. And there we are. Yeah, another defeat. Oh, dear, dear, dear. So that puts us nowhere again. Wow, Derby 6 5 when against Arsenal. High screwing in. Good on you, Derby. That's my boys right there. For Ravinelli, good player. Nine goals in 12 games. That's not bad, is it? 12 in the Premier League. It's not bad, is it? Not bad at all. Anyway, enough about them. Let's focus on us. Because we need to... I think we're going to have to go two up front, I think. I think that's going to have to be the way... I think I'll change it to set to default. Four four two attacking. Um, yeah, we'll see how that goes for us. Ah, <sighs> we'll keep.
keep going to the next one. We'll play one more in this video and then we'll uh, cut the video there and I'll play a few games off camera. Unless I get interrupted by one of my children or my missus. If that's the case, then I'll cut the video and I'll come back to you in a couple of games. Two powerhouses back then, Liverpool and Leeds. How the mighty have fallen in Leeds, definitely. And Newcastle, really, because they were a great team back then. Yeah, and Leeds get it. You can see why they were a good team. Just take cast your eye down that side. You've got Jonathan Woodgate. You've got Nigel Martin. Michael Dubry. I remember him. Rio Ferdinand. Radderby. He must have been brought in. Still in Petrov. Yeah, still in Petrov. They signed him in this game. Wow. Great signing. And then up front, they've got Viduka and Alan Smith. What more does a team need? Harry Kuehl. You know. They had a very good game squad at the time. And um, now they're just about hanging on in the playoffs in real life. I don't know if they're going to make it there. But we will... Uh, enough about them. We need to be focusing on our own bloody fortunes, let alone other teams. I'm just trying to find anything at this point to talk about and be positive about because, let's face it, we're not doing very well, are we? At all. It's just terrible. It's just terrible. It's... It's concerning. When's our next game, anyway? Uh, fixtures, fixtures, fixtures. Um... Oh, no, we're not out of the cup. I thought we was. Sorry, I, I completely lost track of where we were. In fact, okay, so we've got Oxford next and then the FA Cup. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I will... I'll leave it here. We'll play Oxford and then we'll come back for the FA Cup. Speak to you shortly. <laughs>